Surprise, motherfucker. Hey, what's up champs, 104 from Maverick, checking in with another video. This time, I'm going to show you guys how to use the radar to find moving targets on the ground. Let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys, welcome on board. We are on patrol somewhere over Syria right now and we've just received some intel that there's an enemy convoy on the move somewhere to the east, northeast of waypoint 1. So we're going to go ahead and use our ground mapping radar to find them and then slave our targeting camera over to their position and get ready to engage. So the first thing we're going to do is make sure that our targeting pod is actually turned on by flipping the switch here to the on position. Waypoint 1 is on our left hand side to the northeast, so we're going to go and point the aircraft in that direction and switch to air to ground mode. You'll see that when we do this, the ground radar automatically comes up on our right MPD. We're going to go ahead and select the T pod display on our left MPD so we can get an instant view of what the ground radar is looking at, but you don't have to do this. You could just as easily bring up the T pod on the right MPD after you've found the target and designated the area you want to look at with the radar. Now we want to make sure that our radar is sensor of interest or SOI by pressing sensor control switch right as the radar is on our right MPD. We then get the diamond in the top right of the screen showing us that this is our sensor of interest. We'll then switch the radar into ground moving target mode by pressing this button and the radar will default to a 20 nautical mile scan searching the ground for any moving targets down there. We want to set it out to the maximum range of 40 nautical miles as we're around 30 miles from waypoint 1 and we know that the convoy is somewhere in that area. So now as we turn the aircraft to head towards the area of the convoy, the aircraft is going to start scanning in that area and we should pick it up if it's in range of our 40 nautical mile scan. Okay, boom, we have a hit. You'll see a solid line on the radar to indicate that this is the location that the radar is detecting a moving object. Now here's the Gucci part. All we need to do is move our TDC over the target and once again select sensor control switch right and the ground radar will lock onto this target and instantly slave our targeting pod onto that position so we can actually see just what it is that the radar has found. We'll also get some useful information on the radar on what the target speed is on the left hand side, in this case it's 10 knots, and also what direction the target is moving in and in this case, it's 158 degrees. Now if we come to our targeting camera and select sensor control switch left because it's on our left MPD to make it soy, we can then move the camera around to check out the convoy and get set up to attack it with whatever weapon we want to employ in this case. It's that easy. So there you have it guys. Another fantastic tool to use in a Hornet to help you get the job done while you're out there patrolling the skies, delivering as much freedom as possible. I hope you have as much fun as I do. Until next time, Top Gun and Volleyball, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not Scott Manley. Fly safe.